And now I will ask Lieutenant Chris Garcia of the Victoria County Sheriff's Office to lead us in our police report. Please, Barry, yes. The police officer's prayer. Almighty God, whose great power and eternal wisdom embraces the universe, watch over all law enforcement officers. Protect them from harm in the performance of their duty to stop crime, robberies, riot, and violence. We pray, help them keep our streets and homes safe day and night. We recommend them to your loving care because their duty is dangerous. Grant them your unending strength and courage in their daily assignments. Dear God, protect these brave men and women. Grant them your almighty protection. Unite them safely with their families after duty has ended. Amen. Our ceremony is about to come to an end, but before I go, I'd like to do two things. First thing I'd like to do is thank the Victoria Police Department Color Guard for their participation in the ceremony tonight. Thank you very much. That was great. The second thing I'd like to do is invite you all to a reception in the lobby immediately following the ceremony. And now I'd like to address the graduating class. When you begin to doubt the nobility of your mission, or the sanctity of your profession because your heart is heavy, or you feel anger, disillusionment, disenfranchisement, betrayed, or confused, stop and listen to the voices. The voices that rise up from a field in Pennsylvania from a wall at the Pentagon, and from a spot on the earth the world has come to know as ground zero. Because if you listen, you will hear those souls telling you thank you for what you're about to do. You will hear them cheering you on. Let them carry you through difficult moments. Allow them to nourish you and encourage you. And doubt no more for your warriors and champions for those who have gone before, and those most vulnerable now. You are admired and respected for you will be the best at what you're about to do. No one is born a warrior. You choose to be one when you refuse to be seated. You choose to be one when you refuse to back down. You choose to be one when you stand up for those who have been put down. You choose to be one because if not you, then who? Who among you 13 will stand with me and my brothers and sisters in law enforcement? Gentlemen, it's my honor to present the 93rd graduating class of the Victoria College Police Academy, your next generation of guardians. Thank you. This concludes our ceremony. Thank you.